it begins to solidify everything that you've just went through. Good morning. Good morning, everyone. All right, there you go. We want to welcome you to the written test for the 78th Indiana State Police Recruit Academy selection process. So maximum effort to every step throughout the process. We do not have a lot of time to get this training done. So I'm going to move forward very quickly. Hustle up. All across Indiana, we have districts <sighs> waiting for you to finish your training to be a part of our mission. We will not put you out in that field without being properly trained. <laughs> so welcome everybody to the Indiana State Police Recruit Academy. When you get ready to walk through these doors here in a minute, I want you to understand two things. Your life is forever changing. The second thing I want you to know is we are going to challenge you people. Woo! We are going to challenge you physically. We are going to challenge you mentally. Sir, sorry. Sir, sorry what? Why are you late? I didn't say move the marker. We are going to challenge you at all aspects of what law enforcement is about. I hope for my staff, for the rest of the Indiana State Police Department and the citizens of this state that you accept this challenge and you try to come out of this place the best Indiana State Trooper that you can. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. This is the final step of quickening for this recruit school. And this is a big day for me personally. It's a day we get to pin those ISPs. They've worked really hard for them. And I'm sure they know this is coming. I'm sure they know the day. But it's still a big deal. It's a big deal for the staff, a big deal for the agency, and most importantly for them. We will get over and get them out of bed and run a while. Two years ago, we liked you, Tom. Now you're just a really light, bright light at 3.30 in the morning. <laughs> it's cold outside, about 20 degrees, I think. <laughs> yeah. Let's go light these rockets. <laughs> yeah. I don't know if fun would be the descriptive word you hear, but it certainly becomes something that we do each and every year. Good morning, Tom. Again, it's one of those memorable things at this recruit school. We expect a lot out of these folks, guys and gals alike. They're nearing the end of this, and Mike White will play his trumpet and play Reveille and we'll get him out of bed. I play the morning wake up bugle call. people with purpose. Good morning, sir. What's going on today? Going on a morning run, sir. What's going on today? Run, sir. Superintendent's here. You sound so happy. Yes, sir. It's a big day. Class of the quickening. With purpose, people, with purpose. Good morning, sir. Good morning, sir. When we start this run, you come out first and call Cadence, okay? Sure, yes, sir. We'll make a lap around the roundabout. This day is kind of a a day of, of accomplishment, you know. We work really hard. We are tired from the quickening and everything, and uh, we get our ISPs today, which is, which is awesome. We go out front here. I need for you to line up in the roadway in inspection formation facing the building. Clear? Sir, yes, sir. Well, we've all been having, been working hard uh, throughout the academy. Um, and you know, this is a big accomplishment for us. Out front, move. Oh, oh. We've <coughs> passed all the challenges. Now it's just a review for us before we get on the road. And uh, yeah, it's, it's just a big accomplishment for all of us. Morning. Morning, Morning sir. Wasn't a surprise, was it? No, sir. No, sir. That means we got to change it up next time. Probably be the last class where it uh, was expected. Was it YouTube? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah. 
Well, uh, whether it was a surprise or not, this is a really big deal. It's a big deal to the staff. It's a big deal to you. It's a really big deal to me. This is not supposed to be convenient for you. It's not supposed to be convenient for me or for my staff or for anybody else. But this is an opportunity for us to, to spend just a moment. Um, and I hope it's a period of time that you might carry with you the rest of your career. So as we, as we wind down here, uh, you got through the, um, the last three or four days and you should be very, very proud of that accomplishment. For Sergeant. Academy, all right, face. Academy, forward, march. Lip, lip, your lip. Lip, lip, your lip. Lip, your lip, your lip. Even though you know it's coming, this is an absolutely huge deal. It's something we've all looked forward to for the last 20 weeks. Double time! Double time! Five! Five. We don't necessarily know it's definitely going to happen, but we hope for it today. And you hear that trumpet, and you know it's going to be an interesting day for us. And it shows that this agency from the top down loves to work together, loves to be a family. I mean, that's the thing is it's not just a job, it's not just a career, it's a new family. One, they're looking forward to getting to the uh, to the last day because they know that there's going to be a lot of critical thinking that has to be done on that that last day. You get a lot, and I'll get a pose. And then, and then they are also excited about getting to the end of that. They know that there's some special things that go on. Obviously, the tradition of the run that we have, um, and again, it's no surprise because it's become quite the tradition to do that on the last morning. Academy. Back out here in inspection formation in uniform. Clear? Sir, yes, yes sir. sir! Academy, fall out. Ah. Uh, and they're excited about getting their ISPs, another piece of their uh, their uniform to, to put on, and they're, they're proud of that fact. It's a good day for all of us, and uh, we're ready to, to get it done. 22 weeks and uh, now we at the end of the of the training and uh, we're so excited about everything and I think uh, it's uh, it's been a great journey for all of us and uh, we go from then and see uh, what the future holds for us I'm just so happy to be here so lucky and so blessed to be here uh, this is very 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 important to me I started off with the state police as a motor carrier inspector um, I did that for about a year and eight months. Uh, I decided to transition over to the um, law enforcement side of things and not be a civilian anymore. Um, I'm going to keep my certification, so I'll be able to do that as well. Um, but this has been my dream, so uh, that was just a stepping stone, and the state police was nothing but um, good to work with in terms of transferring over. Um, it, was, it was not a hard transition at all. The academy has been difficult, but the transition from one job to the other has been uh, pretty smooth. It means a lot. It's uh, near the Internet Academy, and uh, it's a, a time that we can look back and reflect on and be proud of. The ISPs are a big deal. It uh, symbolizes a lot. Um, those that have come before us and those that will come after us, um, it's something you don't take for granted. I've been waiting for that since day one almost, so it's going to be a good day today. Good morning. Good morning, sir. We all acknowledge that you watched this ceremony uh, from previous classes. And I can only imagine that you just dreamt of being here today because you know that it's nearing the end of this experience. I hope that's the case. This is an opportunity, again, for, for me, but most importantly for you and for my staff to pin you with, with something that's really, really special. That badge is going to be special. There's no doubt about that. But these ISPs are yours. Every single person that's worn these ISPs since our inception has worn similar ones that look just like the ones you're going to get today. 
And as you know, 43 people have died wearing those ISPs. They mean a whole lot to us. They mean a whole lot to us as an agency, and they should mean a whole lot to you as an employee and a part of this agency. So that's why we make this a big deal today. I know you're all wanting to get out of here, you want to go home, and I don't blame you. But again, we talked about this from the very beginning, that everything we do has a purpose. So does this today. And again, I hope that, um, I hope that you'll remember it always. So we'll get through this here in the next bit of time, and then I'll have a few closing comments for you. And then I understand you've still got a pretty busy morning because we will always leave this place better than we found it. And I appreciate that more than you know. On B, C, D, R, A, Rex. Quad A, right, face. Forward, mark. Once those ISPs go on, and I know the superintendent talks to them about uh, uh, carrying on that tradition and doing nothing to dishonor, bring dishonor upon those ISPs, I think that kind of tops it all off. How's your wife doing? Very well, sir. Thank you. I understand there's a bit of a change. Understatement, sir, but yes. I'm thinking about you. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. We never bring discredit to those. Never, sir. Thank you, sir. Congratulations to you. Thank you, sir. Congratulations to you. Do yes, never discredit those. Sir, thank you, sir. Congratulations to you. Thank you, sir. Don't ever discredit those. Sorry, yes, sir. Congratulations to you. Thank you sir. Don't ever discredit those. Never, sir. Congratulations to you. Yes, you never discredit those. Yes, sir. Sir, thank you. So never discredit those. Sir, never, sir.
Congratulations to you. Thank you, sir. Let's credit those. Yes, sir. Don't ever discredit him. Yes, sir. Congratulations. Thank you, sir.
congratulations to you. Take good care of those, don't ever discredit them. Congratulations. Great pride in doing this for you. Thank you, sir. Take good care of those. Don't ever discredit them. Yes, sir. Congratulations. Thank, Thank you, you very, very much. Thank you, sir. Take good care of those. Don't ever discredit them. That's right, yes, sir. Yeah, congratulations. Thank you, sir. Take good care of those. Don't ever discredit them. Congratulations. Congratulations, dude. Don't have to discredit those. Yes, sir. Congrats. Yes, sir. Those. Don't ever discredit them. Congratulations. You don't ever discredit them. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. Take good care of those. Thank you, sir. Don't ever discredit them. Congratulations. Thank you, sir. Keep smiling. Thank you, sir.
those. Don't ever discredit them. Never sir. Congratulations. Yes. Don't ever discredit them. So, congratulations, Drew. Walk me. Go in. Press. Uh, we get to have a small little chat with them. So I take this time and my other staff members take this time to give them a quick word of advice and uh, just let them know that we're proud of them. Take good care of those. Don't have to discredit them. Congratulations. Take good care of those. Don't ever discredit them. Congratulations. Yes,
Let's credit them. Seriously. Congratulations. Take good care of those. Don't ever discredit them. 
Yes, sir. Congratulations. Thank you, sir. Congratulations to you. Thank you, sir. Take good care of those. Don't ever discredit them. The very you, best. Take good care of those. Yes, sir. Don't ever discredit them. I won't. Thank you. Congratulations to you. Thank you. Take good care of those. Yes, sir. Don't ever bring discredit to them. Thank you, sir. Congratulations. Sir, recruit Rainy, sir. Rainy. You take good care of these. Sir, yes, sir. Do not bring discredit to them. Sir, yes, sir. Congratulations. Thank you, sir.
Why be parade the rest? Every single time we do this, I wish I was you. The youthful enthusiasm and all the things that I see as you come forward, I said the exact same thing to all 55 of you today. The exact same thing. Always take care of these and never bring them discredit. And then a sincere congratulations. But now it really just begins. You see, you've got this, you've got this extraordinary opportunity to stand out in front of something very few people would stand out in front of. I'll always expect you to treat people respectfully, no matter who they are or what they look like, no matter what they say to you, no matter what they do to you, you will be respectful in all things that you do. You'll engage with town marshals and city policemen and sheriff's deputies all over Indiana. And I'll expect you to be respectful and help along the way however you can. I've been able to see some extraordinary things as a superintendent of this, of this incredible agency. But nothing I've seen more powerful is the way in which we interact and get things done in times of incredible heartache and sadness and grief. You all matter to me. You all matter to my staff. You all matter to all of us representing this agency. Lean on us. Let us help you along the way. Remember what I told you in day one. We're going to try to teach you how to, to solve complex problems or a complex problem or issue at two in the morning all by yourself with nobody else coming. I think we've prepared you. But as importantly, I think you've taken all of that instruction, all that you've heard, and made it who you are. I'm really proud of you. I am really proud of you. I don't know how many New troopers have been through this ceremony today, but probably um, 350. I hope you'll remember it always. As you go through this complex time where you're, there's gonna be highs and there's gonna be lows. You're gonna be associated and be around cynics, people that don't like what they do anymore. Maybe they don't have respect for what they do anymore. The vast majority, though, are not going to be like that. And I only say that because there are going to be highs and lows. It's natural and it's very, very normal. Lean on people like us to help you along the way. Please. And you'll have this long, incredible, and amazing, amazing career. You all are going to be expected to give more than you'll ever receive. Don't ever expect it to be the other way around and if you do, leave this profession. You all are going to be expected to give way more than you receive and if it's ever the other way around, leave this profession. It's not about you anymore. It's about us. The us for you is now an agency as large as the ISP. The us over these last many months has been this class. You see how you've gotten exponentially bigger. Wait for two weeks from yesterday. You've earned the right. You've earned this day. And you've earned what's on those collars, ladies and gentlemen. You should be very, very, very proud of what you've done. That's why it's important to us to be here with you today. Cold, early rise, inconvenient, terrible food, and all of those things pales in comparison though to what you've all been through. So a sincere congratulations to you. Safe travels today. 
And um, come on back on Monday for Sergeant. I've had a 